Hey guys, Lynn Andrew with the Red Carpet Report. We are here at the Staples Center for the greatest show on earth, the Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey's. They have partnered with Habitat for Humanity for Built to Amaze. I mean, it's amazing. There's gonna be celebrities, there's gonna be animals. I might do a few tricks for you, so come on, let's go check it out. The what, 143rd edition. And how long have you guys been involved with it? Ooh, we've been involved well, with the circus now for over 25 years. We're actually a third generation of King Charles unicycle riders. Our original troupe actually started back out in 1969 by being the first all-black unicycle, uh, excuse me, black circus act. Uh, and we performed over about 19 seasons. Then we had a second generation come back to perform with Kenneth Feld. Now we have a third generation performing with Alana and Nicole Feld. So it's in the family. Yes, it's, it's kind of 360 now again. So tell our viewers exactly what you guys do. Well. We play an unbelievable game of one of the wackiest games of b-ball on unicycles. We're passing, we're dribbling, we're dunking, we're jumping rope, we're doing all these coordinated stunts and just amazing the audience. How long did it take you to learn to ride the unicycle? It takes a long time, like with dedication and hard work, you know, it, it depends on you. If you got the determination, you can learn anywhere from a week to a couple of months, yes. A week? It would take me like a year. Actually, we just have a couple of kids uh, that we're teaching now and they just learned to ride in like maybe two or three weeks and they look like pros already. So everybody is born to a, a, a particular sport or uh, in life. These guys have a knack for it and they picked up on it real quick. Uh, so you have to have kind of like a little bit of a knack for it. Uh, I see, and where do you learn? Like where could I go and say, hey, I wanna learn how to ride the unicycle? Well, we learned in our neighborhoods back in the South Bronx. The founder, Jerry King, actually was concerned with a lot of the social evils in the neighborhood. So he utilized his passion for the unicycle taught the kids in his neighborhood, and then before he knew it, he had a club full of uh, kids uh, doing unicycles. That is so very cool. We'll have fun tonight, be safe. I'm excited to see you guys. I think it's the funniest thing, because between the unicycle and the basketball, I don't know how you do it. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you. You're too kind. You're too kind. Awesome, thanks guys. Thanks for, thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Okay. I'm about to do an amazing trick for you. If you like it, leave a comment. Okay, here I go. Ta-da! <laughs>